New tonight, Mexico's government banning shark cage diving off the coast of Guadalupe Island. Previously, local touring companies have taken thrill seekers out to sea and then let them get up close to great whites while inside the metal enclosure. But that is no longer the case. Our Sarah Legre spoke with marine experts and a former cage diving tour guide, and she joins us with their thoughts. It's an island drawing charter boats out of our San Diego harbors to Mexico for a chance to get up close and personal with some great white sharks. This ban now bringing all of that to an end along with a whole new wave of controversy. Tourists, divers and researchers worldwide have flocked to this biodiverse paradise, Guadalupe Island, for some face time with the great white, all from the comfort of a cage. The presence of the sharks is just majestic. It has been a second home for San Diego diver and shark expedition guide Manuel Lascano for the past three decades, but his time leading tourists in and out of Mexico has come to an end. We are losing a lot of money and we are losing a lot of uh, people that had these very high expectations for years you know, to come and see the great whites. The Mexican government now banning cage diving to protect the great white species, calling the observation of sharks behind bars dangerous. The move comes with a cost halting business for charter boat owners, diving companies and researchers here at home. It has been very, very hard and it's, today it's a disaster. Marine research biologist Nicole Lucas also warning this form of protection could backfire. Without cage diving there, it's even harder for us to know what's happening there. Adding it only leaves a sea of opportunity for poachers and illegal activity, hurting the species and the environment in the long run. So when the when the boats are out there with cage diving operations, they're there all the time and sort of keeping an eye on the sharks. So now that nobody's out there, there is a possibility of commercial fishermen or poachers taking white sharks. It breaks my heart to know that those animals are going to be like without any protection. In support of their argument, the Mexican government cites a case made back in 2016 when a great white shark smashed into a cage, trapping it momentarily with a diver, saying this is just one example of how this could not only endanger the species, but human life. For now, along the Embarcadero, Sarah Legre, Fox 5 News.